So one of our favorite people, Little Nas X, he opened up on Twitter recently that he had brought his family to a gay bar. He talked about how it felt like a release of the stress that he had held since he was 13 to finally see his family fully accepting him and unlearning their homophobia. Kiki numero uno, Lil Nas X brought his straight family to a gay bar. Have you ever done that? What are we all talking about? What do you think? I think that's awesome. Right? That's awesome. It's nice to see somebody being supported. You know, and for the mm -hmm. most part, like, we're gay, and we, for the most part, we, we keep that part of our world away from our straight family and friends, right? It's not like a, a hidden thing. It's just kind of separate. It's kind of like, you know, we don't want to make anybody feel any certain kind of way, even though we have to live in a straight world all the time, yeah. right? But to show them a little glimpse of our world and not think that it's complete and total debauchery and sex everywhere, like they, like the stereotype of our community, yeah. you know? But I feel like sometimes... It's them, mm -hmm. but sometimes it's us. Yeah. You know, like I remember I waited, I came out to my mom first and I waited to come out to my dad. I was like, oh, it's my dad. You know, you see in the movies, oh, the dad is always the one who has a problem with it, whatever. And I waited probably like two or three years before I came out to him. He was like, yeah, I know. So I yeah, knew that. Literally, I, I know. Uh... And it's like, in my head, I had all these things of like, oh, he's going to have a hard time with it because he's a dad and blah, 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 whatever. And he had, it, it was easier with him than it was with my mom. Right. Sometimes we automatically think the worst yeah. and it's not always that way. All the stories don't have to have that crying ending, <laughs> you yeah. know? Yeah. And, and what I love about this that, and, and that I have to totally agree, little Nas X's uh, brother, he tweeted like soon after he said that he had a great time at the gay bar and that he actually had more fun at the gay bar than he's had at some straight places. I mean, we do play better music. We do. I'm sorry, straight people, but we really do. We do play, we do play way better music. I brought my brother when he first moved here from California. And like the day he got here, mm -hmm. he dropped his stuff off at my grandma's house. He was staying with my grandma at first. And I'm like, come to my show tonight. And dropped his stuff off, came with me to my show. It's the first night in Florida. I think he went to actually, I think there were two that night. There was one. In Fort Lauderdale, one in Miami, and he came the whole time. He had an awesome, awesome, awesome wow, time. But you didn't even start slow, Damien. You just kind of like forced him into it. He just got off the plane, and you're going into Gayville, USA. Sorry, buddy. Uh, listen, sink or swim. <laughs> but I'm glad that it worked out, though. Like, yeah, good time. I've, I've, you did. I've taken, um, I, I read a story the other day that Queen Latifah had taken um, Tupac to his first gay bar. Can you just envision that? Like how dope sauce is that? And then he had a fabulous time. You they know? must have been all over him too, because oh, he was God. gorgeous. He was gorgeous. Yeah. You know, Queen Latifah sent me a bottle of champagne many years ago. Work. Yeah. She's gorgeous too. She is a she cutie, really right? Is. And I love that she's just so gay. <laughs> like she Absolutely. can't hide it for all those years that it was like, come on, girl. Come on, girl. Come on, Queen La. U N I T Y. <laughs> So, did you enjoy the show? I know you did, so make sure to click subscribe so you won't miss any of the events, news, or interviews right here on the Faye What Show. Ring the bell at the bottom of the screen, right there, so you'll be alerted every time we're live. You can also click on the Happening Out Television Network logo so you can see all of the shows on the most diverse LGBTQ plus media network. Find out just what we're doing to bring the L and the G together right here on the Faye What Show. Get the week started with me.